Hello, everybody, and welcome to this Team Gentleman podcast for Friday, August 19th. I'm your host, Scott Labrie, and join alongside me, Uncle T-Bag, Tyler Sund. Hello. Scratching his ear. Yeah, I got something in there. And all day, Eric DeShane. What up? How's it going today, guys? Hot. Beautiful. Hot. Stupidly hot. hot. Give me Balmy. Yep. Balmy. <laughs> when you sit all day, man, you feel the swass. Sweaty balls. It sucks. Kind of like to step out and air it out and just sitting in all day. Yeah. It's gross. Well, you know what? What came first? The word balmy or Stephen Balmer? Because Stephen balmy. Balmer is a very balmy man, if you've ever seen him before. What's a balmy man? What the hell? That's a, that's a phrase that a I've never man? heard. What's balmy man? Yeah. Oh, well, like if you think think of the word balmy, balmy is like <laughs> hot and wet outside kind of thing, yeah. right? Like well, well, it's really humid, humid and moisturous. And Stephen Ballmer, if you have, if you don't know, former former CEO of Microsoft, oh, current yeah. owner of uh, the LA Clippers. Okay. He did a press conference one time where he was like, "Developers, developers, 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 developers," and he's just like just drenching sweat down his like oh. pits and stuff like that. Dang it. Okay. Yeah. He's very sweaty. Dude. He looks like a very like someone who would sweat a lot. Yeah. yeah it's like wow. he does have that vibe of like he, like he's wearing a three piece suit and it's like, it's wet underneath his jacket there. Yeah. Because yeah. he's yeah. just like so intense all the time. Yeah. Like yeah. He, even like watching like basketball on the sidelines. Mm-hmm. Like normally if you, if you own the team you're sitting up like you're sitting up on top you're up in the stands watching everything. He's yeah, he's so. he's front court like yeah. right in the he yeah went, he went to the NBA bubble for some reason but but. Hey man, if I owned the team, I'd be front row too. Fuck. And he's like sitting with his friends and stuff like that. And mm-hmm. whenever like the Clippers, there's a <laughs> clip where like the Clippers do a good play or something, and he's just like, yeah, and he's like rubbing his friends like like this. <laughs> like, 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 like this? Yeah, yeah, I do that to people. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. I do that to our a little right too much. Like yeah. I grab his leg and squeeze him. Like, are we getting fucked up tonight, buddy? Or what? <laughs> he's much. like, ah. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck, man? We're out of basketball games. Stop. <laughs> Let go of my leg. <laughs> There's cameras everywhere, dude. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah. yeah. That's awesome. So, shout out to Steve Ballmer. Hmm. Or originator, originator of the phrase balmy, because he's so sweaty. Okay. I don't know. I, uh, feel, I feel a thumbnail coming on here. Yeah. Thumbnail, yeah. <laughs> Ballmer. Yeah. But uh, today's movie club postponed a couple days. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Because this guy took a sweet time watching it. I did. Mm-hmm. But uh, but I finally did it. We finally did it. We all watched this masterpiece of a film. Yeah. A wonderful. On, on Netflix there. Wonderful debut film to J.J. Perry, I think his name is. Mm. Vector. Yeah. He stunt said he was, a, he was a stunt guy on John Wick. He's a, a stunt guy, guy. yeah. Lots, of, lots movies. of movies. Lots of movies. He was Every movie that him. had stunts, he was in it. Mm-hmm. Hey. You know what? Story wise of this movie, whatever. It's you know, it's silly. It's, it's silly. It's silly. And it's fun. That's what it's fun. Like, it's yeah. a fun summer movie. Yes, that is very true. Yeah, like I, I wasn't bored watching this movie. No. I, I was shaking my head like a lot of times. Yeah, but I didn't feel like checking to see how much longer it's going to be. Mm. I never felt that at all. Yeah. But you know what? The stunts were fucking cool. The yes. Fight it, when you have a stunt director... Cool. Yeah. We have a new it? Scorpion King director. Like, he's yeah. obsessed with fucking vampires landing on their heads, <laughs> flipping in midair, and <laughs> oh, landing on their heads. And the contortionists. <laughs> yes. <laughs> What's up with all the contortioning? Like, but it just made me squirm. Every fight scene, I'm just like, oh, fuck. Like, Where, it like, was chucks, good. chucks her, like, head first, and you, like, scorpions. The scorpions and, then she just, like, and twists gets, and do it. And, like, like, walks. Her, the back of her head touching the back of her... Her butt is like, Jesus. Trying to crack her neck and she just like folds around him like whatever. I'm just like, oh, my skin was just crawling the whole time. Like the fucking breaking bones. and It was, oh, dude, it was real it was good. It was, it was good. It was good. I liked it. It was good. It was silly. It was fun. That's what. It, it was a lot of fun. Yes. Yeah. They knew it, the whole premise of, yeah, it is stupid and silly, but they had fun with it. And I think that's what shows the most too. It was yeah. like, yeah, it's. It wasn't so. It wasn't like watching Army of the Dead, where it was so serious that this premise of it just being a fun action movie doesn't go. It's not. It's not wasted. They took it's it way used. too seriously. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was yeah. when I finished watching it. I was like, that was my first thought. Mm-hmm. I was like, this is the tone that Army of the Dead should have had. Exactly. And I yeah. would have enjoyed it like a million times more. Yes. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. No, just just the idea of like yeah. Vampires living in California, the sun, hottest and sunniest place on earth. That's dumb, but yeah, mm-hmm. like, turf whatever. wars and shit. Like, yeah, 
Oh, whatever. they got that okay. vampire sunscreen. It can go out in the daylight for yeah. like 20 minutes. I'm like, oh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I guess, like, and there's a whole sense. like underground system of like this whole like a vampire hunter system that's just oblivious to the rest of us. It's like, okay, yeah. it's whatever. Like for Men in Black and yeah, RIPD yeah, like, and all that shit, but yeah. whatever. Not that we've never seen before, but it was still, yeah, Shit that watch. they could have expanded on, but they were like, Kate, this is who we are. We've been around for a while. Let's move on. Yeah. And I, I love that, yep. honestly. Like, let's just move mm-hmm. on. So I think I, I think if you get too lore heavy, then it becomes like really, like, then you're yeah. poking more holes instead of, you know, asking questions, you're poking more holes in your swords. Just go it's over like, it. Oh, Who cares? Yeah. It's silly. They know yeah. it's silly. They're intending it to be kind of silly, yeah. mm-hmm. but they want to deliver really good action, mm-hmm. some goofy juvenile jokes. Mm-hmm. And yeah, I was, I was in for it. Yeah, man. Yeah. It was good. There's a lot of like silly, like good laughs here. Like the, he mm-hmm. <laughs> goes to the union and the boss is just like, I don't, I don't know who the actor is, but yeah. like, He's like an older dude, but he's got like this fucking red like red mullet, red like, mullet and his hair's black. Like, yeah. You can tell it's dyed, and you don't know if it's like a wig. It, yeah. it must have been. It must have been. He's like constantly like doing this, like, sh- like shuffling his hair. They were just like, like "Okay, yeah. you're gonna draw out of a hat. This is what your wig's gonna be for the movie." <laughs> and he just much. fucking pulled it out. He's like, "Ah, shit." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's probably oh, what happened. Uh, exactly what happened, or something. Because it was like, no way, that's. On purpose, but man, eh, whatever, it's... Snoop Dogg yeah. should not have been in this movie, though. Oh, Snoop Dogg was the best so part. Good. Oh. He was so good, man. He was so cool. Oh. His Gatling gun part was pretty fucking sweet, oh. though. Shows up, big loaded Dodge, yeah. Yeah. full western gear, cowboy boots, mm-hmm. hat. Listening to country, I'm like, oh, this is not <laughs> yeah. Snoop Dogg. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> and then, like, every every woman at the union, he's just, like, this just old lady over him, yeah. Don't call me. I'm like, holy fuck! Get the fuck out! It's so funny. Man. And then, of course, at the end when he's got the his fucking like UV bolts of v- yeah. vest or whatever, he does like the West Side for life. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it does West, West Side for life gang signs. Yeah, just... and then I'm like, oh great! I'm like, but it can't be dead, right? It can't be no. dead. And then, of course, I'm like, all there, it was was like a UV bomb. Yeah, that's all it was. Yeah, like it couldn't yeah. have been like an actual explosive. Yeah, so he comes out of the fucking manhole. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Lights up a huge then, blunt. Yeah, and then uh, drops the best line of the whole movie. That's why I love LA. All the vampires. <laughs> all the fucking <laughs> vampires. All the fucking vampires. And then he starts playing a Snoop Dogg song as he's walking away. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, and you just just, yeah. straight cheese, man. Oh man! But it was so good, though. It was refreshing. I looked at Carla, yeah. but you know what? That was that was that was pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Mm-hmm. If any, if any, like, I don't know, real criticism is just like, well, that child act- actress was bad. She was like, mm-hmm. child actress, child actress. Yeah, yeah his daughter. Oh, his daughter. Yes, yeah. yeah she was yeah. like, Anakin Skywalker. Yeah, bad. bad. Like, yeah. yeah, that was pretty bad. Okay, who who can bring their kid into work today? Pretty much. You're going to be the one. Like and just say this line. Don't even have to memorize lines or practice. Just say it and we'll move on. Yeah, yeah it did sound like she was like, they just had a cue card on the side and yeah. she's like yeah. reading it a lot of times. Yeah. But. Yeah, she was pretty bad. But Jamie Foxx is really oh, dude. I think there was yeah. some improv going on, like especially between mm. him and Dave Franco. Fuck, man. Oh, we were yeah. talking about the orange powder in the butthole. Fuck, I don't know why <laughs> that made me laugh. I'm like, what happens? What happens? I mean, I think I'm like, I want to know what happens yeah. when it gets in your butthole, right? Like... So much worse than you thought. Yeah. It's like, oh, I mean, fuck. it happened to me before, but god damn. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> then he comes back. I got some in my butthole last night. and It was way worse than you said it was going to be. <laughs> it's like, what What happened? I want to know, like, the one plot hole that I wanted to know. Like, what the fuck? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah. Oh, overall, 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 overall enjoyed it. positive. Yeah, I did enjoy it. Mm-hmm. I give it like a six and a half. The six and a half is usual. Like, it's sitting right now on a fifty-six one. on Rotten Tomatoes. We think that's fair. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. I, I would I think it a little put bit it higher. I closer to seventy. It's like yeah, like I certify it fresh at least, but yeah. Like yeah, low end on that. But I mean, besides the stunt, which by the way, the most stupidest reload scene I ever seen in any movie, but I still loved it. That where that one the guy has with that bullet, one bullet. The one bullet. I'm like, oh, this is okay. That's so just too much. dumb. Oh yeah, with a yeah. That's Brother, Scott, Scott, Scott Atkins. Scott and, Atkins is the yeah. one martial artist. I'm like, yeah. sweet, I know this guy. Yeah. And he does that this freaking stupid flip just to get one bullet in this chamber mm-hmm. and fire it. I'm like, that was so fucking dumb. But uh, oh, whatever. Yeah. Well, when like, he fucking stabs the one vampire yeah. in the throat and spins it around in a circle. And then Carl's like, holy shit! I'm like, really? Like this is fucking. That's retarded. It's, it, it's <laughs> over the top, but it's like. Mm-hmm. They always like they they kind of like 
you know, at least like mm-hmm. kind of spell it out or like at least kind of give some weight to it. Yeah. Yeah. Like these guys are the best guys from Arizona. Like they, they've killed all the fucking vampires in Arizona. Right. Yeah. Now they're coming up to California mm-hmm. or whatever. Yeah. So it's like, yeah. it's like, oh yeah, these are guys that are the badasses. And then as soon as yeah. I saw Scott Atkins there, it's like, oh yeah, he's going to go f- pop off like fucking crazy. Right, so. Fucking just, yeah. That whole yeah. clean up the hive. I'm just like, oh, it's a hive. Fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> this motherfucker just kicked me up the goddamn stairs. <laughs> <laughs> he gets kicked up the stairs. You never see that. <laughs> this guy like fucking, fucking kicked, just, me, kicked yeah, me up. Boom. He just like kicked him down the stairs, but he got kicked <laughs> up, up the, stairs. the stairs through the wall. Like <laughs> holy fuck, man! And everybody's just a rag doll in this movie. And all the vampires mm. are like, yeah, fuck. yeah. I, I, yeah, I'm not gonna fucking complain about it because it's like, why aren't the vampires just using guns, man? Like it's modern society. Why aren't they yeah, really, really? Shooting these guys? They can just shoot Jamie Foxx and the other guys, and no problem, right? But. Ah, yeah, eh, but that, that but again, you're putting logic into movie. Exactly, it shouldn't have logic. And you know yeah. what? As soon as you start questioning that, yeah. it, nothing makes sense. Yeah, exactly. And that's, that's the way it should be. Just yeah. like you know what? Don't worry about it. Just enjoy, just enjoy the movie. Maybe they also like you know they want to lay low and stuff like that. You don't want to invite people into their houses and stuff like that. You mm-hmm. know, because they're like trying to keep keep quiet and you don't want yeah. guns being around everywhere. I guess maybe mm-hmm. I don't know. Nah, but... That's true. Right, just one vampire, like one vampire, just each vampire <laughs> just have a pistol, mm-hmm. you know. Like it's America, everybody can have a pistol, right? No willy, willy nilly man, but mm-hmm. could have just fucking clapped him. What'd you think of the of Franco's turn at the end there in the last third? That was kind of silly, yeah. It was good, it made me think of like uh, a lot of like um, idle hands, yeah, that kind of humor, yeah. I think they took that, like, yeah. especially with the head falling off and they're trying to keep it attached, and they're mm. trying to fuck around with it. I got a lot of idle hands vibes from that, and I'm like, yeah, this is. I see what they're doing. That's funny. I can see that. And he yeah. was, he was, he was really, honestly good. He was, he was funny. Yeah. He was good. Like he played the nerd, and he was like scared, and he mm-hmm. pissed himself and everything. <laughs> and <laughs> Juniper Green suit. <laughs> Juniper Green. <laughs> like, oh my god, that's like the one line that stuck with me. It's like, what, what is that? It's, it's my Juniper Green suit. Like I, I blend in with who? We're like, what the fuck <laughs> are you talking about? It's California <laughs> in the middle of summer, and you're wearing a fucking suit. <laughs> How are you supposed to blend in with that? Yeah. Now nah, he was really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. He pulled it off pretty well. And you could tell like he was doing a lot of ad lib stuff. Mm-hmm. But it was it was clicking. Yeah. I don't know how Jamie Foxx kept a straight face with him for, for most of it. Like Oh yeah, they're probably... they had to have cut like so much. Oh probably, yeah. There's about takes or something. Mm-hmm. Where do you even go find find stuff for that? Let's just gets uploaded to Netflix YouTube channel if it's, I think it's YouTube, yeah. If, if, if it's it does thing, come maybe. out, yeah. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, trying to think, like trying to think of on YouTube, I think. Trying to think of one that's done that. I can't think of one offhand, but I've always seen some before. Where I think if you go to extras on the movie too, it'll show. Oh, maybe yeah. making oh. this, making that. I'm sure of it because I know mm. on uh, Witcher, uh, when you go down to extras, it shows like the whole making of mm. the monsters, making of the mm. whatever and mm-hmm. set design and stuff. That'd be one movie where like, this day shift where it'd be. Lo- I have lots of fucking outtakes. I'm sure. Oh, also, for sure. Lots of funny ones, yeah. And some really sweet shots, too. Like, the mm. drone... You can tell it's drone, Drone like, footage, yeah. Fuck, man. That shit was legit. Mm-hmm. Or the one scene where they're in that, that truck, and it's, like, in the cab, and all of a sudden it comes out, woof, flies out over top of them mm. as they're chasing. Like, holy fuck, that's a sweet-looking shot. Yeah, like, yeah. There's some There's some really good mm-hmm. cinematography in this. Yeah, a lot of action scenes were great. No, like, yeah, they were really great. Yeah. That's what the heart was put into it, man, and it shows. But it's no exactly. Yep. Yeah. As soon as I heard the premise, I didn't even bother to watch the trailer. No, nope, same. And I'm like, I, I thought I, I was so going stupid. in there with like with high levels, like it's going to be so dumb and stupid, and I'm not looking forward to it. It's going to be like some silly little, little, you know, gang movie or something like that. I thought it was going to take itself seriously. Like they were going same. to try to be serious. Same, yeah. And but then, then did, we, like, I watched it. My nephews were like, "This was awesome." Like they're they're both 14. They loved it. They loved every second of it. So, yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and just like random. Vampire friends, like they mm. don't have impulses to just drink your blood, like that didn't make any sense. Yeah, you know? like, yeah, fuck, whatever. Yeah, but I guess mm-hmm. the IV bags kept it under control. I guess they kind of put that in there, like, oh, I got IV blood bags. She's a nurse, so she must get blood from she, the hospital. Yeah, yeah. yeah. but right, again, so. you're thinking about it again too far. Right? I know, yeah, that's so, me. I'm so, like, well, yeah, just let it go. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, right. uh, yeah. That was the one thing I was like, I don't know if I, they should turn Dave Franco. Like, I think I don't know. Mm-hmm. I kind of seen. It. Him could have been, should have been just a human. Just thing, a human but, fighting. I would have thought too as well. Yeah. And even if they had like killed him, it would have had a, a little bit of weight to it too. Right? Yeah. Like, oh shit! Like no, this bitch really needs to die, right? Like, yeah. But. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. Oh, I'm getting like an allergy attack real bad. Oh, uh, it's tearing up. <laughs> yeah. Um. 
And yeah, I think they, they kind of set up a sequel as well, kind of in the. I, I would hope so. Yeah, I mean, they kept talking about this. I'd be totally El Jefe guy who, yeah, was the, like the head honcho, yeah, the, um, drug cartel or something like that. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense too. Vampire. If you're gonna be because yeah. yeah, they're talking about him, like he seemed to have a few. There's a few times that he was mentioned, and I'm like, well, I wonder if he's gonna show up in this. I'd be kind of. Cool. And they were saying like the oh, these vampires are like making guns with the silver bullets or whatever. Mm-hmm. Like they're gonna. Go to war. Or you're going to, you're going to go to war with somebody. Yeah. Or something. So yeah. it's like, huh. Which is like, dang. Yeah. So. so maybe since this one, obviously it did well. Because mm-hmm. it was like number one in Netflix movies. Mm-hmm. Right? Like, yeah. I mean, they obviously made their budget back. I can't imagine what the budget must have been for this. I don't think it was too bad. Was, I don't think it was yeah. too crazy. Yeah. But you could tell, like, it was it was decent. But they they had to have easily made it back. Because mm-hmm. I know a lot of people, it would be right up their alley. Mm-hmm. This, this was a good movie. I really, I actually would be excited to see a sequel to this. Mm-hmm. They, yeah. Expand on it. Yep. Yeah. So. Yeah. But, yeah, yeah. Highly recommend it. It's a great movie. Okay. The list out. It's definitely not on the top of our list, though. No, I wouldn't put it there either. But it's on my list. It's still there. It's still, yeah, it's still better think... than Top Gun one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, movie Club. See, so, yeah, my current ones right now: Shawshank, Goodfellas, Goodwill Hunting, Children of Men, Top Gun, and Hustle. For me, I'd probably put that. Uh, Probably number five right now, right below Children of Men, and between right above Top Gun. Yeah, yeah that's number five right. right now on my list. Yeah, yeah, I think. You think I it was think... better than Hustle? Absolutely. Really? Mm-hmm. Uh, my my personal list, I know I have Top Gun, then uh, Hustle is above that, so I put I put it in between Hustle. Mm-hmm. I think is. You right? Yeah. Like yeah. Hustle. Yeah. You don't shoot no basketball in this movie. Thumbs uh-huh. down. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. You're in L.A. Can't have a L.A. Lakers player show up. LeBron right. James. Everybody he's going to be the sequel. Of LeBron James mm-hmm. is the sequel. Right. Yeah. Yeah. He's he's one of the head vampires. Yeah. Yeah. Because I mean, like, you have like a uh, other L.A. legends. Who would it be? And else would be like an L.A. legend that could show up. I mean, you could get like Doctor Dre or Ice Cube or something like that. Yeah, I'm not too familiar if you want to go with rap the Western route, Raptors. But, yeah. Yeah. Jack Nicholson. <laughs> oh God! Spilling, spilling the Tupperware of chili. <laughs> <laughs> that I love that beef so name. much. Oh my God! <laughs> oh. He doesn't go to games anymore. Like he might have. Yeah, I don't know how he's doing. Yeah, yeah I don't, I don't, who even knows how he's doing? Yeah, he's up there. I think he's is he pushing eighty. Let's see. How old's my my main man Jack? And I think like I don't know. Maybe maybe that meme kind of like shamed him not to go to games or something. Well, yeah. I mean, he was, was born a... in 1937. Yeah, he is. That is a long time ago. He's 85 years old now, guys. Yeah, yeah. Like he's yeah. Shit. Oh, I just read a fun fact. He has six children with five different women. <laughs> he would. <laughs> Atta boy, Jack. <laughs> he would be that guy. <laughs> he would be. Yeah. Well. Um... Anyway. I hate to cut this kind of yeah, episode a little short, all of a but sudden, yeah. you're having a little bit of a That's reaction. A bit of I don't want I don't want to keep sniffling in uh, in people's ears mm-hmm. that long. So, mm-hmm. uh, any idea for uh, next movie club? Well, if you guys want, uh, Cameron did recommend Cameron. It uh, was it pray. was pray, pray. Yes, yeah, and pray. that is on my list to watch. You yeah, guys so. would enjoy that one, I think. You mm-hmm. saw it already? Yeah. I oh, I oh, saw yeah. it the moment it was released yeah. on Disney before I even saw his comment. I'm oh, like, yeah. oh, a new Predator movie. I'm watching it. Yeah. Do yeah, that. could it's do good. that. It's mm-hmm. good. And do yourselves a favor. If you're going to watch the old ones and have any interest in it, watch that first before you watch this one. Cause watch the old ones first, yeah. Watch, watch the new one and watch the yeah. old one, it's going to be hard to get through. But, yeah. Uh, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> you, you've seen the old ones, though, right? <laughs> nope. Well, okay, wow, yeah. Right? What? Uh, <sighs> Maybe we'll we should do that one first, I think. And then if, if we're going to do Movie Club specifically, it should be that. Predator. And then watch Prey, like we did with Top Gun. Yeah, I guess. Because that's, that's not you would fair. Like it, yeah. Because the punch. I mean, I, I probably would, but. Yeah. You'd probably like it. Well, we can discuss it. Yeah, we can discuss it. We'll All I know is that I'm claiming. I'm going to claim one of the movie clubs in September. Because mm-hmm. it's my birthday, and I, 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 I'm allowed to do that. Sure. I think I'm before you, but okay, sure. I mean, you can, you can do it. Yeah. <laughs> Go ahead. What is it? We're going mean, to. Well, I don't know. Should I say? Sure. It's not going to. Uh, we're going to switch from movie to TV. Oh. And I'm going to make you guys watch the first three episodes of Dave. 
Oh yeah, the with that um, little Dicky. Little Dicky, yeah. On Disney Plus, Dave. Just the first three episodes. First three episodes. It's an hour. That means it's an hour and a half. It's the length of a movie. Okay. I think, I think that's good for a movie club. Okay. Yeah, I've I've said I've talked about Dave like a million times. Have I not heard it? Why is it not? Kicking yeah, he in? mentioned it like two times on this Why podcast. It's it like my favorite show. My it's so good. Your favorite show. I mean, I got a lot of favorite shows, but <laughs> it's my favorite comedy show. Okay. It's not kicking in. Sorry. And and, and episode three is especially funny, so it's it's a good kind of okay good cut off. Okay. So that that's Let's you got that. a month from now, basically until that. But okay, three episodes to Dave. How many episodes until? Why well, is this not kicking in? I think in. it's wow. uh, yeah. ten each season, I believe. How many seasons are there? Two. Two, Two seasons. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Started watching Sandman. Speaking of TV shows. Oh yeah. Watch the first episode. <laughs> okay, yeah, I can see why you. <laughs> this is gonna be funny. First episode <laughs> felt like a whole blockbuster movie. <laughs> yeah. Just like a like a fucking full fledged movie story. Mm-hmm. Like, damn. Yeah. yeah. And so, and there's, like lots lots of shit happens in the first episode. <laughs> yeah. Like a century's worth of shit happens. Man. Like, <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck, man. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I'd get back into that. Yes. Poor Scott. All right, well, mm-hmm. I gotta go blow my nose. So, uh, thank you so much for watching on YouTube. Like and subscribe, comment, share with a friend. That always helps us out. Yes. If you're uh, listening on podcast service, leave us a rating, subscribe to the feed, and then uh, head over to our Facebook page, like the page, submit a question for Ask Us Anything. We're not, well, we're still halfway through August. We're still halfway through August. We got a, a little ways. A little ways still, yeah. Predator, is that what we decided on? And then, uh, Submit a review. Predator? Is that what we decided on? We'll talk about it. We'll talk about, we'll about it. it. We'll yeah. talk about it. We'll figure it out. We'll let, we'll you, let know. you know to watch. Until then, adios. Goodbye. Have a great weekend. Goodbye as well. <laughs> See us. <laughs>
And then uh, head over to our Facebook page, like the page, submit a question for Ask Us Anything or not. Well, we're still halfway through August. We're still halfway through August. A little, little wise still, yeah. yeah. The wise. Um, a little wise. And then uh, submit a review. Predator, is that what we decided on? We'll talk about it. We'll talk about it. We'll, talk about it. we'll, we'll, talk about it. we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll let we'll you let know. know to watch. Until then, adios. Goodbye. Have a great weekend. Goodbye as well. <laughs> See us. <laughs> oh. Allergies, eh? Allergies, what the fuck? Oh.